Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're at the pool with the Paw Patrol toys and we're going to do a test. Will they sink or will they float? Each pup will dive in one at a time and we'll start at the front of the line and it's Marshall who's first. Will he sink or float? Splash! It looks like he's sinking and now rubble. He's the heaviest, so he's sinking quickly. And I'm sorry, Rocky, I know you don't like water. And he sinks. And now Chase is on the case. He floats! Our first Paw Patrol toy that floats. And now it's time for Zuma's turn. Zuma's a sinker. And last but not least, it's Skye's turn. She feels heavy too, and the heavier the object, the faster they sink. Now how are we going to get our pups back? Well, Tiny Treasures is on a mission, collecting all of the pups from the bottom of the pool. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm, we're missing someone. Do you know who it is? It's Rocky. And there he is. He has to remind us that it's only five feet deep. No diving in the pool. Safety first. This is the deepest part of the pool. The middle of the pool is where Rubble's standing. It's four feet and six inches deep. Sky is standing at the shallow end. Three feet, six inches deep. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today the Paw Patrol pups are on a mission. They're at the North Pole. The Igloo Power Station is starting to lose all of its power. Pups, we need to dig for more orange power crystals, says Skye. The lights are starting to dim and the computers are starting to turn off. I'm on it, says Chase. He hops on his orange dog sled and heads out into the field. He uses his strong sense of smell to sniff in the snow and the ice. <laughs> I feel like they're close, says Chase. I can smell them. The snow starts to get very deep. Luckily, Chase is very powerful in the snow. He's starting to get very tired. <laughs> All of a sudden, out of nowhere, one of Chase's best buddies shows up. It's Marshall. You shouldn't be out here alone, Chase, so I've come to help. Marshall digs and digs in the snow with his claws until he uncovers a bright orange energy crystal, just what they were looking for. Good job, Marshall. What teamwork. Let's get these back to Sky right away. Hop on my dog sled. Marshall has to use all of his strength to get out of the deep snow onto Chase's sled. He did it. And off they went back to the igloo. Good work, Chase and Marshall. You found these just in time. The igloo was just about to run out of energy completely. As it turns out, Marshall had found two more crystals on his way to help Chase. They put them in the glass tube and turned the switch on. The crystals even gave off heat so the pups could warm up. Come on in, Zuma and Marshall. Zuma was outside watching the big polar kitty. and Marshall was running around, having fun in the snow. Now all the pups are getting warm. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today is a very special day. It's Skye's birthday. And look, Skye, there's a big, 
happy birthday balloon in the tunnel for you. Let's have a closer look. It says happy birthday in gold letters. There's green, red, and blue confetti inside. Okay, Skye, we have one more surprise for you. Poppy and I bought you a very special gift. Let's go and open it. We wrapped Skye's gift in a little red box with a white bow. What is it? It's an LOL surprise little sister. And look who's come by to say hi. It's Kitty. Skye wants to open her surprise ball right away and see what little sister she can add to her collection. We open the first layer and the clue is story time. Now we unwrap layer number two. And we found the sticker that says changes color. First we'll open the little keychain ring that attaches to the ball. And now we'll open the little accessory. How cute! Little pink heart shaped sunglasses. And it comes with a little pink and gold crown. Let's see what our doll looks like. Oh, she's super cute. She has black and white hair. And her name is Little Heartbreaker. Now let's give her a bath and see what color she turns. She has a little pink heart around her eye. The white part of her hair turns pink. Her diaper turns black. And let's see the back of her diaper. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today the Paw Patrol have a special mission. Rubble and Zuma aren't here today, but Apollo came to help the pups. All of the pups are going to fit in this one Fisher Price vehicle, and they've got some music to get them motivated. Marshall is driving today. Apollo rides in the front seat. Rocky and Chase are riding in the middle, and Skye gets the little pink seat in the back. They have to drive deep into the forest. Good thing they have a big vehicle to get them there. There's a lady and her dog and they're stranded across the creek on a mossy rock. She'd been hiking and all of a sudden the water started to pour in. The pups spring into action. They find a log. They use all of their strength to push it over to the lady and her dog. Okay. Now you can slowly walk across the log, says Skye. All of a sudden, Skye falls into the creek. Oh no, Skye. There she is. Are you okay? I'm okay, guys. Luckily, I'm a good swimmer. And guess what? I even found some trash in the creek. We need to get it out and throw it in the garbage. Plastic isn't good for our waters. Ew, looks like it's been here a while. Skye hops onto the rocks, back up where the lady and the dog have made it across the log. My name is Kim and this is my dog Morgan and we are so grateful you could rescue us. We were so scared. The pups offered to give her a ride home. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. 
Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're going to play a fun, colorful nature game with our Paw Patrol chalk. We have a purple Marshall, a yellow Rubble, blue Chase, green Rubble, orange Chase, and a red Marshall. And you can play this game at home with your chalk. First, let's draw a red circle with our red marshal. And then we're going to search for things in nature that are red. This bush has a dark red leaf. We can put this in our circle. Let's look for one more thing. Ooh, a flower petal that's just fallen off the flower. This is a dark red. We'll put it in our circle. Now we'll draw a green circle with our rubble. There's lots of green in nature right now since it's springtime. Look at the little ant rubble. It's so teeny. The leaves on this cherry tree are green. But we've also found a snail. It's not moving, so maybe it's sleeping. And we found some green minty leaves. Look at all of the green. We could put so much in our green circle. There's some ivy and a hydrangea. Oops, I dropped my blue chase, but he's okay. Sometimes chalk can crack when you drop it. Time to find something in nature that's blue. This could be a little more difficult, but we found some little blue forget-me-not flowers. We've used the colors red, green, and blue, but we're missing one primary color. Red and blue are primary colors. What's the third one? It's yellow. And yellow rubble is going to draw a yellow circle. Right away we spot a yellow leaf. It's got a little brown blemish on it. And very close to the leaf was some yellow flowers. We'll put a petal in the middle of our circle. Well, that was a fun nature hunt today. Thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye.